Critical Blow has been an amazing set to open. The art is some of the best I've seen in quite a while, especially when it comes to the SCRs, so you know I had to go back in and open up some blister and premium packs. Will I be able to pull the god rare Gogeta in this opening? Let's find out together! What's good everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Open Mango. Today we're going to be opening up more booster packs of Critical Blow from the Dragon Ball Super Card Game. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, turn the notification bells on so you know when my videos go live and share the video out with someone who you think might enjoy these openings. Uh, Critical Blow has been fantastic for us. Uh, we pulled all of the secret rares in the set, the Gogeta, Cumber, and Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, uh, and I'm going to be getting these graded so hopefully in the next couple months those returns will come back and we'll see what the grades are. Uh, hopefully tens. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm excited to get into this. We're still looking for that God Rare Gogeta. So hopefully we can pull that here today. Uh, I'm going to get these packs out of their packaging and meet you guys back in just a sec. All right, I got the packs all out of their packaging. And funny enough, the blister packs had their corresponding corresponding pack arts within each of the blisters. So that was pretty cool. Um, so the you know, Gohan blister had the Gohan pack and Broly and so on. Uh, and I've never opened the premium packs because it was just hard to find. And as well as the uh, blister packs within within the stores. Uh, so that was that was really weird. Um, I had to wait a couple weeks to even see a restock of them. Uh, but now the set's so cheap as far as the booster boxes goes. I, that's definitely the route you want to go if you want to pick up packs. But uh, I always like opening up blisters and premium packs of sets because uh, you do get in the premium packs these promos. Uh, which look phenomenal. This one's uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, Flying Fists. So that's pretty cool. So these two here in the middle are from the premium packs. And then these are from the blisters. Now I will mention, I found one blister pack back when the set first came out and it was the Janenba pack art. Uh, and I was like, man, this hopefully this is the pack of Destiny because I really want to see if that one has the Gogeta God Rare. So we'll save that one for last, but yeah, let's get into it. Hope you guys are doing well, having a great night, great day, wherever y'all are. And uh, hopefully you guys have been enjoying this set. I know I have, especially if you've you know, seen the channel and watched all the videos, because holy crap, has this been a phenomenal set for us. Uh, but we'll dive right in. And for premium packs, typically uh, I've seen one hit per premium pack. Sometimes you can get two, and then sometimes if you're really unlucky, you get only one. And it looks like we may have something in this pack already. We have a Broly. Oh, no, never mind. I was just playing. We have a regular rare Gohan. Uh, that leader Broly looks really cool in the reverse foil. Uh, definitely glad to have that. Uh, I think I pulled it maybe once before in one of the openings. Maybe twice. But, I mean, I've opened so many of this at this point, I'm just like... Where is the God Rare? I'm only looking for the God Rare at this point. And a lot of y'all have been uh, showing support for that, so I appreciate you all. Uh, you know, Jeff, um, Just Right. Oh, well, uh, I blew right past the reverse, which was a Pycon. Uh, and uh, Billy Joe. Uh, Just, yeah, I think I mentioned Just Right. Uh, and all y'all out there, Pedro, all y'all. Ooh, oh, SR, Super Saiyan Gogeta. I don't think I've ever, I've, Hold this in any of my packs. So that is a fantastic addition. Happy to have that. Yeah, I, thanks. And, and and so many more. Sorry, those are just the ones I could think off the top of my head. But uh, appreciate you all for all the support. Uh, I, I can't can't believe it. We're almost also to 500 subscribers. So make sure to subscribe uh, so we can do our 500 subscriber special. And as you guys know, um, we have. I'm gonna pull. Pull this over here, an EX Delta Species booster pack to open up for the 500 subscriber special. So if you guys want to see that, subscribe. All right, we have Shenron, Piccolo, Goten, or Gohan, Goten, Vegeta uh, Reverse, and then a Dote Janinba, Unapproachable Power. Last pack of the first premium pack. And yeah, um, we have a total of what? A 16 packs. Hopefully we can pull at least better than ratio from like half, uh, a little over a half a box. We have Upu. We have Corrin, which looks really cool in the reverse foil. Uh, we have Piccolo and then Gohan. Moving on to our next premium pack. 
I also saw Gravity J's video, um, like his most recent video. I don't know if it's his most recent as, uh, after the recording of this one, but uh, he pulled like the Shenron Secret Rare from Wild Resurgence, um, which I have yet to pull. We did pull the uh, two uh, Goku and King Kai uh, Secret Rares, but no, no other Secret Rares. We have a Fu Laboratory, which looks phenomenal. And then we have the Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Yeah, hopefully one day we can pull that one too. Uh, but I, honestly, at this point, I uh, might just consider like purchasing those cards because I know that I, I'm, I'm kind of like confused as to why Bandai did this in particular because like they have what? Uh, they're now pretty much splitting the card game into two, Fusion Worlds and Masters. Uh, doesn't make sense. You're kind of like diluting your fan base, especially with when it comes to like packs. Like you could do something like Pokemon where you just insert a code card. Uh, we have Fu, Supreme Intellect, and then a Janemba, uh, where you, you can just pull the cards you need. And if you need like those older cards, just kind of make them available or craftable in the card game itself. Kind of like how um, Mash Duel does it, or even um, Pokemon now. I think they use like Dust or something. Uh, PCT, PCTG, Pokemon Trading Card Game Live. I'll just go ahead and say it that way. Uh, because, I don't know, it feels like Bandai's going for like a cash money grab with Super Saiyan, uh, uh, the Dragon Ball Super card game. Hopefully they kind of pivot and kind of make it a little bit more streamlined instead of trying to buy like two products. Uh, definitely going to open up some Fusion Worlds when it comes out. Uh, I don't even know when the release date of that is yet, but whenever it comes out, we'll definitely do a couple openings on it. But to just to kind of see how things flow. Uh, big fan of Bandai games, not really Battle Spirit Saga, but like the other three. Okay, we do have our hit for the premium pack here because I can definitely feel uh, a little bit thicker of a, a cards here. So we have Broly, Lone Warrior, Piccolo, Power Beyond Awakening, and ooh, an SR, Super Saiyan, Gohan, and Goten, Battle Ready. That looks really cool. I don't think I've pulled this SR either. So that's fantastic. Nice. Two SRs that we have not pulled yet. All right, next pack. And hopefully you guys aren't expecting me to pull Secret Rares constantly out of this set. Because, man, it is hard. Uh, we just got really lucky uh, with those three boxes. Because we pulled the Gogeta, then the Cumber, and then the Gohan back to back to back. And I was just like flabbergasted that that happened. Like the, 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 like the fact that that happened just the way it did. I don't know if I'll ever be able to replicate that. Hopefully I can, especially with the new sets coming out. Uh, I haven't pre-ordered any uh, just yet. Uh, my local game store I, uh, that I typically pick up some product from, uh, I, you know, he, uh, the owner is aware that I might be picking up some of the boxes. So hopefully, you know, it lets me know. But uh, I'm not really like diving in to jump on it because I don't know what the cards kind of look like. I don't like to go uh, into sets like wanting to know what the cards are, but for like Dragon Ball Super, I definitely do. Uh, at least like the higher end cards, right? Like the secret rares and the uh, god rare. Because we are getting another god rare in this next set. Uh, we have another Broly, uh, Devil of Destruction, which looks phenomenal. And then a Cumber. Next pack here. So far, only two hits, which is, I guess, on brand for what we're expecting to pull. Um, I would I would like to see at least two more hits. Maybe another Cumber and a Son Goku. Uh, if there's an SPR I'd like to pull, it's that uh, Goku hugging his grandpa. Now, that's such like a wholesome uh, image. All right. We have Korin and Goku. That one also in reverse foil looks amazing. All right, we have a Janemba, Paragus, Sachimaru, Fu, Bora, Gohan. Nice. Uh, we don't really have anything in this pack, it's just a Gohan, but this reverse Soul Punisher, the Cleansing Light reverse foil looks amazing. All right. Yeah, I think uh, opening 
booster boxes of this set for me is is definitely the way to go. Um, I still have like, I think four more booster boxes of this set. I uh, might pick up some more just cause like I said, it's like super cheap. Like I was surprised like a God Rare set doing this bad. It's typically not the case, but it's just insane. That just kind of shows you like, you know, if it, you know, Bandai, if you're listening, like listen to your like fan base who's like opening these cards. You have like uh, an entire different, you, you know, you have multiple bases. Ones who play the card game, ones who collect, um, and ones who like to invest in it. So like, I'm a little bit of everything, but like you, you can't just have a set come out and then like, a, you know, not even a month later, uh, it's like below wholesale price for a booster box. Um, we do have something here. So we have Fu making the next move, Son Goku and an SR Beerus, which looks pretty cool. But I, I feel like Beerus needs more SPRs. Like I haven't seen many Beerus SPRs Yeah, sorry I went on the rant there. I kind of want to do some like more discussion type videos. Let me know if you guys are into that. Uh, definitely love to hear from you. Um, maybe like once a week or once every couple weeks, we kind of talk about the state of the market, state of the card game, things like that. I think that'd be pretty cool. We have a nice Sun Goku Days of Adventure, Reverse Foil, and a, a Seal Super Warrior Paragus. All right, now this is a pack that I was like, it was the only one left on like, I think the week of release, like that Friday, and this is the only pack I could find. Hopefully this is the one that is the pack of destiny. Or, <clears throat> let me try again. The pack of destiny. Yeah, let me know how you guys like that. All right, we have a Dr. Hedo. Apparently that's also a really good deck right now, Dr. Hedo. Don't really play the card game, but I also watched Super Playa's uh, video, which uh, Tony G actually ended up pulling uh, the Secret Rare Gogeta out of it. So that was insane. That was awesome to see. We have a Sun Goten and a rare Broly. Womp womp. Uh, but that's okay. Uh, it's expected after doing so well on this set. Um, but yeah. Let me know what you guys think about that. Like Bandai doing this split with Fusion Worlds uh, and uh, what, Masters now. Yeah. And uh, also, as you guys noticed, like I have the secret rares I've pulled uh, from the various like openings that we've done. Also, I showed you like the three from this particular set. And then I've also pulled like two of the, like I said, King Kai and Goku. So yeah, I, I love the art. Uh, I, I wish that, um, you know, Bandai would kind of get their shit together and make it that, like, you're not spending so much money on, like, two different products as opposed to just one. Because you already got, like, three other uh, games. And from what I hear and what I'm seeing, Battle Spirit Saga ain't really doing too well. So might as well focus on the ones that are doing well. You know, you have five projects or four projects. Uh, one Piece is doing really well. Fantastic. Digimon. You need to throw some more support on Digimon. You guys tarnishing my boy right there. That's my that's my GOAT game. Love playing it. And then Dragon Ball Super, like these are phenomenal cards and arts. Like, come on, Bandai, do better. All right, enough of that rambling. Uh, appreciate you all for sticking around and listen, listening to me. Uh, and let me know what you guys want to see in the future. Um, I'll see what I can do. And I'm really excited to keep going forward. Be sure to subscribe because we got we're on our way to 500. And on, and then on to a thousand if we hit a thousand subscribers you best believe we're going to be doing some insane stuff for that so uh, appreciate you all have a great rest of y'all's day and i'll catch you in the next one bye